Okay, as you can see, I've already weeded all my vinyl. We're gonna go ahead and use the wet method to put the base down. So I'm gonna take off the coating from the acrylic piece. This is just a paper coating. I am using a, uh, a white blank. They come in clear, black, all a bunch of different colors from Third Degree Laser. This one right here is the white one. I, I like using the colored blanks. This is just rubbing alcohol. And I'm going to use a lint free cloth and wipe this down. You wanna make sure there's nothing on your blank or you will see it under your vinyl. Okay, just set that aside and let it dry. It dries pretty fast. All right, so first thing I'm gonna do, get me a piece of transfer tape. This is good stuff right here. This is from Expressions Vinyl. I like it because it's small. I don't have to cut big pieces down, so it's perfect for badge reels and keychains and ornaments, that kind of stuff. This is the back, or the base for my ornament. to the side and then bring that up. So for my wet method, this is um, just regular water with a drop of liquid dish soap. Doesn't matter what kind. Just spray that on there and I'm going to spray a little bit on the vinyl itself on the sticky part. Okay, and just rub it in. This also works with paper transfer tape. Use what you like. I like to use this because I can see through it. Okay, and we're going to line this up. I'm going to stand up to do this. It's easier. Now, you know if you've worked with adhesive vinyl, once you take this and stick it on something, it's not moving. So with this, you can reposition it. So get it where you like it. And then you're going to take your squeegee and push your water out. Just take your time, push it out. This is also going to eliminate any bubbles. Okay. And then bring your transfer tape up and go slow. You may have to push as you go, especially with um, this kind of transfer tape doesn't want to let go as well, but it is possible. I like to wipe the water away as I'm going. You always want to pull a diagonal motion. Don't pull it up because it will come up and you'll get bubbles under there. I'm just wiping the water as I go. Wipe it off and you can see there's no bubbles. Just gonna take a cloth and wipe off my desk here. All right. I am going to build my Santa before I put it on here. That's gonna make it easier for me. And then I'll put the rest of it on after that. Actually, I might just go ahead and put the words on now. I'm not really sure. When I'm doing my um, acrylics, I always make sure I have a picture pulled up on the screen somewhere, either my phone or my screen, or I print out a picture so I can look at it for a reference as I do um, my ornament. So let's just go ahead and put this on first since it's here. Don't use the same piece of transfer tape that you just used because it's wet and it won't pick up your vinyl as well. You can use it after it dries, obviously.
And if you've watched any of my other videos, you know that when I weed my vinyl, I always put slits in the top before I actually weed it. So that way when I go to build everything, I know which way it's supposed to go. I don't have to worry and wonder, is this the way the eyes go? Is it supposed to go this way? So it just helps my brain to remember which way things go. Alright, this is the back of Santa. If you don't want to use it, you don't have to use it. I just like to use it because it makes it pop off of the ornament. I am taping down the base because it's curled a little. It might help me line it up a little better. You don't want to burnish this down too much because you're not picking up the back, you're just laying down the top. So slowly roll it off. This works best if you use a piece of transfer tape that's not too sticky, you don't want a fresh one. All right. It's best to go from the bottom up, so you're going to put your black down first, then your red, and I'm going to do this part. I'm going to take that piece of the hat out of there, the little pom-pom, so I want to make sure that it lines up right. I'm going to do the same for this. Just helps me to line it up a little better. a little piece at the bottom of his mouth. And this is going to go underneath his lip. I'm having a hard time seeing. Lighting is not the best right here. Okay, that goes under his lip. And then that gets laid like this.
Okay, now I'm going to pick up the whole transfer. So this is a newer piece of transfer tape. This is the one that I used to, to use the wet method, and it has dried by now. So now we want to pick up all of Santa. Here we go. 